So we're here today for a workshop that ECFR has organised with Telefonica on the subject of internet regulation. So this is the second in a series of workshops we're organising. The first was in London, uh, here today we're obviously in Berlin, and then we're moving on to Washington, then Brussels, and then we finish off in Madrid. We believe that to really tackle the issue of internet regulation, you need to bring together um, all the different stakeholders. Uh, and, in, and when it comes to governing the internet, that's private sector. Uh, if you think about it, uh, all of the platforms are owned by private sector companies. You need to bring in civil society because all the communication conducted online is from user to user, citizen to citizen. And then you have the state trying to regulate outside of this. One of the key things is how do we create uh, an online space, a, a digital public sphere that, that doesn't hinder um, people to form their political opinions freely and independently, but actually supports it. But I think we should find a way that, uh, to enforce uh, uh, those rules that are um, valid in the, in the analog space, also in the digital world. So no hate speeds, no uh, uh, aggressiveness, uh, uh, no threatening of people. So I think the key issue on regulation is how do we grapple with the, the new type of economy and make sure it serves a public interest. Bringing the right actors together and uh, create together a stable, secure and free internet. Some of the, the key questions that came up today were not uh, whether or not we should regulate, but how we should regulate. So uh, smart regulation, better regulation, not just more regulation. This regulation should be constantly revisited uh, for a review system whereby uh, you see whether or not it's working. Is it having a negative impact? Is it having no impact? Uh, is it having a positive impact? So actually the question of internet regulation uh, calls upon us to actually completely change the way in which we understand regulation in general.